got settled in for the night sit. Oh, it's about three o'clock. We got in here early today. <clears throat> We're expecting some rain right around dark. And yesterday, we've actually had this spot twice this week and had some pretty good sits. Uh, and we actually tried something new today. We noticed on camera that a lot of the deer were coming from across the road, actually, coming from actually where the truck was parked. And obviously when we were here and the truck was parked there, they weren't doing that. So we got a ride out here for my dad tonight. He dropped us off and we're hoping that makes a difference. Um, it's been on and off rain all day. We've been seeing deer out all day moving. They were moving pretty good yesterday before the rain. So we're gonna sit tight tonight and hopefully get some deer. kidding me. I've never seen anything like it in my entire life. I got arrows. I got arrow there. I got an arrow there. I got an arrow there. Hey. This is this is just I don't I have no words for how bad our luck has been and if that doesn't show how bad it's been and that we just caught a break. That's a break, all right. Dude, I, sm I couldn't hit that tree any better. Dude, I think that second shot you got wrapped up in the headphones. 
I got something. I don't know what it was. Dude. I don't, I, I have no words. I don't know. I don't know. I just hey. know that that last shot, I absolutely hammered her. <laughs> but before that, you had a hell of a shooting performance. Dude, that one, I was right on her. I know. She didn't take that very well, did she? No. Did you see? I wouldn't, wouldn't have it any other way than a goddamn circus. <laughs> no. <laughs> I can't. You got any arrows left? No. <laughs> mm -mm. I got one field that plus. <laughs> There's a mangy squirrel in here we should tag now. Oh. I, I couldn't, I almost couldn't hold my bow back anymore. Did you see me? I'm shaking my head. I'm like, are you kidding me? <laughs> oh, she definitely was on her scent track. On the way I back. know. I, she tracked us right to the tree. She got right here. She said, oh no. Well, that's the first soaked red arrow of the year for me. She didn't take that one far. That one. <laughs> what about the other two? Well, we got, uh, here's, here's one little mud on it and here's the second shot when she was right underneath us that just, the arrow just disintegrated. All that's left is the fletchings. No knock, no, uh, no, I don't know, I lost 27 inches of shaft there. <laughs> I would take up the blood trail, but I think we'd just be wasting her time. She's toasted right over here, so. Yeah, she was smoked. I'll give it back. Well, here she is. Uh, I gotta say, that was one of the most interesting hunts I've ever been a part of. But this old lady decided that today was gonna be the day. And uh, she let me get a couple cracks at her. So, but honestly, that's a big testament to our scent control. I mean, she was 360 degrees around us. She was dead downwind of us. She actually followed her foot tracks right to the base of the tree. As you saw, she literally followed right to the ladder when I was at full draw, which felt like for 15 minutes when it was probably about 30 seconds. So, uh, Henny and I have had a struggle to start this year. It's been slow and we've had a lot of bad luck and it seems like nothing could go our way. So I feel like it was only fitting for us to have a circus hunt to get one. So uh, we're gonna have meat in the freezer and we're gonna go back and celebrate this one with the boys, so thanks for watching.